Hey guys, it's Bart Johnson here, NAB 2016, again here at the Black Magic booth with Kendall. And uh, Kendall, last year you guys released several products. One of them, of course, was the Video Assist. Yes. Well, you guys have a new unit out, which is similar to that, but a little bit larger, a little bit more capable. So why don't you tell me what we're looking at and what we got going on? Okay, so yeah, last year we had the Video Assist. Uh, that was an HD model. It was mm -hmm. a five inch screen, did 1920 by 1080. This is our seven inch screen, high resolution. It's 1920 by 1200. Okay. Now the cool thing about this one is uh, it records the SD cards. You fill one up, it automatically jumps to the other. Great thing is though, you can record SD, HD, and Ultra HD on this one. That's what people were asking for. So there right you now, go. It's, the uh, yep. it's got 4K, can record for, or UHD exactly. if you want to get, you know, picky yeah, there about you it, go. but there sure. you go. Yep, and this still has, you know, your headphone jack, length controls on there. Um, and it's all touch screen on here. The other great thing about this one is obviously you have HDMI uh, in and out, but we do have full size SDI connections here that are recessed. XLR connections, there are many, but you can always go with an adapter out to full. Yeah, you can yeah, always get XLR. a breakout cable and, and you're exactly. fine, so. Yep. And, and I like that you mentioned that, that uh, with the full size SDI, you have them now recessed. Yeah. So it keeps it nice and compact. You're not worried about those bumping into things, getting broken, and also your cables will just snugly go in there and sit. Yeah, exactly. And then again, just like the, the previous model, uh, we have two batteries on the back. One will drain out and it'll automatically jump to the other one. So you can hot swap these if you need to. Now these are LPE6s. Are there other plate options available or are you guys sticking with LPE6? We're just sticking with these, yeah. I mean, right you can now. pick up your own adapter for anything to LPE6 if yeah. you really wanted to. Exactly, you okay. can do that or you can always come in the power right here. In the DC power. Yep. What is the, the voltage range on the DC power? 12 volt. So 12 volt, yeah. okay. Yep. So if you can connect it to a you know like a, a V mount system or something like that, then you're fine. Yeah. Now in terms of the HDMI and the SDI, mm -hmm. um, does it cross convert? Can I take uh, an, eight, an SDI signal in from my from my camera, be recording that, and then pump out an HDMI? Do you know if it cross converts between the two types? Not sure about that one. Okay. Yeah, I don't know. We'd have to test something like that, especially on this new model. It is shipping now, so okay. uh, yeah. Something we could test. Okay. Yeah. But it does have both SDI in and out and does, HDMI yeah. in and out. So, yes. Yeah. So you can send more stuff downstream. Exactly. Yeah. Perfect. Yep. Well, it looks like a, a great screen. I know a lot of people were very happy about the uh, the video assist last year, especially because of its uh, its price point for what yeah. it could do. And you guys are recording to SD cards, which is great. Yeah. Um, so what are what are some of the recording formats in this that you're recording to those SD cards? So you can do the flavors of ProRes, okay. and then uh, DNX uh, HD, DNX HR, you okay. can put on there too. Uh, the great thing about this one too is that these are hot swappable. So like again, once one fills up, then you can switch you that can out, pull, one and pull it out, out, put it back in there. Yeah, inexpensive media on SD cards. Yeah, that's a big one. The fact that it's inexpensive and you can still record that ProRes to it. Yeah. So you said this is shipping now. It's available yeah. Uh, yeah. already. And uh, what is the the price on this? Eight ninety five. Eight ninety five. Uh, I mean, you know, it's just a great addition to, to any DSLR. Maybe someone wants another option of, of recording. You can record one thing in the camera, and then you can. Record Record another here. Yeah, you can hook it up to an Ursa Mini uh, camera, and of course you have the screen there. But if you need something over here, another recording source, you have it. Yeah, it's a it, it's a great screen. It's a great screen size, um, yeah. and for the price, I mean, you're coming in below, you know, even just you know monitors that are seven inch of that same resolution. So sure. the fact that you also have the up to UHD 4K recording in there as well, yeah. it's uh, it, it's a nice little piece of tech for that price. <laughs> Well, thank you for sharing that sure. with me. I appreciate it. Yeah. Guys, uh, like he said, this is available now. So if you're interested in a, a great little portable 4K recorder for whatever camera setup you've got going, uh, make sure to check this guy out. And stay tuned, guys. Got a lot more coming from the show.